Here we have the BMW iX3, the newest Neue classic cars that they're out there. And BMW did well. They have a, a free car there where people can go in and then one where nobody can touch so you can film it a bit without 2,000 people in front of it. If your company has electric cars as company cars, of course you want your employee to charge at home. It's cheaper for you and it's easier for the employee. Tronity has a software solution for you to know how much you have to pay your employee for charging at home. With the fleet manager you manage your employees and your cars. Tronity connects to the cars and knows exactly when the car is charging at home and how much. And then you get an easy monthly bill for your employee. If you want to know more, there's a link in the description below. What's so special about the iX3? It's the new platform. No e classic like I said, we have an 800 volt system, we have 109 kilowatt hours. I don't know if it's usable or it's the, the gross capacity. Can charge with a peak of 400 kilowatt, WLTP range 679 to 806 kilometers. For an SUV, the drag coefficient is better than in the Volvo ES90, even though it's an SUV, like I said. Um, this is the X-Drive, uh, 50 X-Drive, has all-wheel drive, 479 horsepower, takes 409 4.9 seconds from 0 to 100 kilometers an hour. The new design with the smaller grill is amazing. I like it a lot. This is way better than BMW did before. I mean, we have the other cars there and they have gigantic grills in the front. This is now small. This looks modern. This looks futuristic. That's exactly what I want. The wheels, door handles, everything is optimized for low consumption. Also something nice, even though it's an SUV. And even in the rear, I think this car looks amazing. This is again, it looks a bit narrow on the top, but that's exactly what you want. This is more future. I thought it would be almost the same. The old uh, X3 or iX3 looked horrible, the last version. This looks good. Pretty long, so there will be a lot of space. Well, that's fine. And here we have the version where everybody can get in, but there are 50 people here. I maybe try in the afternoon to get into this car. I won't be making it now. Production starts in the fall of 2025, so very, very soon. And it gets to the customers in the beginning of 2026 in Europe, and then in the summer to North America, which is interesting. I like that. Uh, top speed, by the way, 210 kilometers an hour. Also, not too fast, not too slow. I like that for an SUV. That's good. It is being built in Hungary, so in Europe, that's nice. We have a trunk that fits around 520 liter. If you put the seats down, 1750 liter. Um, and we have a trunk with 58 liter. It can tow up to 2000 kilograms, so even a bigger caravan should be fine. The car can also charge with AC 11 kilowatt or an optional 22 kilowatt charger. Of course, there will be other options of this car, not just the big battery that we have here and all wheel drive. And for an all wheel drive car to have 800 kilometers of range for an SUV, that's amazing. It will have vehicle to load, vehicle to grid and vehicle to home. That's very cool. But that car really looks very, very promising. I can't wait to drive it and see it on the road and see if the range is really as expected. Again, the, the drag coefficient is amazing for an SUV. Um, I'm very, 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 very uh, happy what BMW did here. And I was never a big fan of BMW but they did very well with this car. With the technology, now we have to see the price, of course. I mean, if it comes out and it costs 70,000 euros from the start. So I just, I just saw the price and it's this car with the big battery 
uh, starts at uh, 70,000 euros. I was right. <laughs> But uh, technology seems to be very, very good. If you want to follow me on Instagram, Better Live One, and if you want to support the channel, there's a Patreon link in the description below. And here on YouTube, there's also channel membership. And if you want to know what's happening behind the scenes, I have a third YouTube channel behind the battery. But that's it for me. Thank you much for watching. Have a great day and take care. Bye.